In this problem, we'll simplify a complex rational expression. This is called a complex rational expression because it contains rational expressions within its numerator and its denominator. We can simplify this by multiplying using the LCM, or least common multiple, of all the denominators that appear within the complex rational expression. The denominators that appear within the expression are a cubed, b cubed, a, and b. The least common multiple of all those is a cubed, b cubed. So I am going to multiply by a cubed, b cubed over a cubed, b cubed. This is 1, so I'm not changing the value of my expression because I'm multiplying by 1. When I finish the multiplication, I should have no, none of these denominators left. I will have cleared out those denominators and then I can simplify like I've simplified before. Using the distributive are multiplying here. I have, first of all, use the distributive property in the next step. 1 over a cubed plus 1 over b cubed times a cubed b cubed all over 1 over a plus 1 over b times a cubed b cubed. Multiplying numerators, multiplying denominators. Now, I can use the distributive property and write this as 1 over a cubed times a cubed b cubed plus 1 over b cubed times a cubed b cubed. All that is over 1 over a times a cubed b cubed plus 1 over b times a cubed b cubed. Now I can perform those individual multiplications. Multiplying 1 over a cubed times a cubed times b cubed gives me b cubed, because a cubed over a cubed is 1. Multiplying 1 over b cubed times a cubed b cubed gives me a cubed. In the denominator, I have 1 over a times a cubed b cubed. I will have a cubed over a, which gives me a squared, times the b cubed. And finally, I multiply 1 over b times a cubed b cubed. I would have the a cubed plus b cubed over b, which gives me b squared. Now I need to see if I can factor. I can factor. Let's see when I factor if I have any common factors. In the numerator, I have a sum of cubes, which factors to b plus a times b squared minus ba plus a squared. The denominator has some common factors. a squared b squared is a common factor to both terms, so I factor out a squared b squared. And I'm left with b plus a. Now that the numerator and the denominator are factored, I see that I have common factors, b plus a in the numerator, b plus a in the denominator. I can cancel them, I remove a factor of 1, and I write what's left in the numerator, which is b squared minus ba plus a squared, which is not factorable over what's left in the denominator, which is a squared, b squared. And that's the simplified form of this expression.